Destiny's next major expansion was Shadowkeep, and it starts with us seeing Eris uncover something on the moon before being met by a red phantom. We head to the moon and eventually come across a pyramid ship and the Half Prince Crota, who we end up fighting before he's joined by Gaul and the Fanatic. To save us from this, Eris pulls us through a portal and tells us about the pyramid ship and that we need to find a way inside it. She also says that we didn't actually encounter Crota and that, and they were just nightmares of our past. After a bit of investigation, we learn that we can use essence from the nightmares to create armour that will protect us, which leads us to hunt down the nightmare of Omnigal and retrieve its essence. The essence alone isn't enough though, so we head into the Scarlet Keep and find information about an item called the Cryptoglyph, which we then go and get and give to Eris, who is now being haunted by the phantoms of a past fire team, which is witnessed by Ikora, who came to the moon to see the pyramid for herself. We then head out to hunt the nightmares of Skolos, Tanix and Fogoth, taking their essence and crafting more armour, which allows us to enter the pyramid ship. Inside the ship, our ghost is possessed by Sutton, and we end up defeating the nightmares we previously escaped from. We're then led towards an artifact, and when we touch it, we have a vision that involves us speaking to someone who looks exactly like us, and they tell us that they are our salvation. And that's pretty much the end of Shadowkeep.